Ja. Yeah. Ich denke, tschüss. Game, 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 Went down and raided some charity shops, and I've got Isaac here. Say uh, hello, Isaac. Hello. He is my son, and he is four. And I thought uh, it's been a while since I, he done this with me, so I thought we'd do it again. But, um, some more like, pickups today from some charity shops. Um, Box and complete, in decent condition. Do you want to show them what it is? It's X Men. <laughs> Next dimension. That was one ninety nine charity shop. Um, put it up there. That'll do, thank you. Next game, a game was one in the same charity shop, which is Freedom Fighters, Boxed and Complete. Can you say Boxed and Complete? Boxed and Complete. That'll do nicely. Another one, Boxed and Complete, I've not got Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King. There you go. You have to make sure you show them. Did you show them? Yes. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Um, this one, uh, boxing complete as well. Actually, I didn't you know this one had instructions, but Worms Blast. I'm sure I've played this, but that was one pound fifty at a different charity shop. I just, I just raided the charity. We raided the charity shops, didn't we? Yeah. We just went in the mall and took all the games. Yeah. Went, went and went. Have you have got? Have you got any games to sell? Uh, maybe. And then I bought them. Next one's boxed and complete. I have, I think I've heard of this somehow. I'm not really sure, but um. The box isn't the best, just outside of the box, but um, maybe the back's slightly sun faded. No, I don't think it is, but it was one pound fifty, and it's Herdy Gurdy, Herdy Gurdy. Is that how you say it? Don't know. On a pile. The next one is boxed and complete, and I seem to be doing all right at getting these. I'll show you in a second. Um, boxed and complete. Never heard of this. It's called K K O Round Two: The Kangaroo. Some sort of platforming game, and um, the girl. It was a charity shop where they don't have the discs inside the cases, so the girl was ticking them out. And I seen her put in a nice little 8 megabyte PS2 memory card into the box as well. So I've, I'm seeing be collecting these recently. And this one was 50 pence in the same place for some reason. Boxing complete, whereas the rest were £1.50 or, or whatever. And it's mashed, fully loaded. There you go. And then. Yeah, I might what? I might put this on for program or. Okay. Do you think that'll be better? Yeah, because you guys will ruin it. Will ruin it? Yes. Good thinking. <laughs> and then when I was in one of those charity shops, I, I heard the woman, old woman say to the assistant, she was like, um, we'll just price those Nintendo games. And my ears just went, what are you saying? And she was like, hey, don't do that. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> it's not these headphones. It's supposed to be engaging with the audience. Um, they just price them at fifty pence because they don't have instructions. And I was like, "What?" And I, for some reason, I didn't ask about them at the time. She said, "Just put about fifty pence and if they sell, they sell." But um, we went um, ping. My computer went ping. We went to the park and flew a kite, didn't we? And then yeah. we went back to the charity shop and I looked in the charity shop and lo and behold, there were some Nintendo cartridges sitting on the sitting on the shelf for fifty pence each, and I couldn't believe it. I never find. Games for this system in charity shops, especially not 50 pence each. But the first one, are you tired? Yes. The first one was Super Mario 64. Let me just show them. See the 50 pence each sticker? And I've not got a gun to do that. That's genuine. Super That's Mario. Cool. No, I've not got a gun that can print a price on a sticker, though. I've got a gun to shoot things. Uh. Not a gun to make a price on it. So Mario, Mario, Super Mario 64, which I already got. The next one was Holy Magic Century. Again, which was 50 pence, good holding up. Um, never heard of that game before, not even sure what it is, but for 50 pence for an N64 game. That's right. And the next one, which I've been wanting for ages and ages and ages, um, again, 50p, was Diddy Kong Racing. Bargain. And finally, was another amazing one, Mario Kart 64, for 50 pence. Uh, excuse me. 
What do you say when you burp? Change for me. <laughs> um, so four and six, four games with depends, and I've I've got them. Yeah, it's right. And um, I've got them all apart from no. There's only one that I've got, and that's Mario 64. The rest I've, I need surprisingly. So it's happy days. And um, oh okay. yes, go. Why would you be show them Wally? We'll show them Wally. Yeah. Wait right, in a minute. Hold on. I'll get yeah. it. I'll get it. Why? Because it's a bit awkward. Um. No, I'll get it. <laughs> I'll get it. I don't want you to die. Oh. There's sharks on the floor. Sharks. Yeah. No, and, um, not. I'll always pick up PS2 games that I don't have, especially when they're a pound, two pound. Car charity boot shops, charity boot shops, charity shops or car boots. Yeah. Isaac wants to show you Molly. Yeah. He's coming. Is he coming? Yes. Don't drop him. You need to sit up on your seat and hold him up. Okay, I guess we can get in. You're squidging in? This is very professional. Right, hold it up. What's his name? Bobby. Whose is it? Uh, Daddy's. <laughs> it's Daddy's. <laughs> it lives in Daddy's room because we don't want Wally to get broken and he's got a remote control and he moves and stuff and he's awesome. But you've probably seen it sitting on the shelves behind me for God knows how long anyway. And what remote control is way up there somewhere. Remote control is up there I think. I don't know. But that's it. One, two, three, four, five, five six, six, seven, eight, nine. Seven PS2 games for cheapness. And then one, two, four N64 games for 50 pence each. And another 8 megabyte memory card for the PS2. Happy days. Happy days. Happy days. <laughs> we'll leave it there, guys. Very quick, quick video. As always, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Don't touch that. Bye. Um, and I will catch you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Do you have a monkey in your pants?